just back for a quick update on my Journal of Stitchery project that uh, Rachel and Sarah over at Roxy Creations are running for the next several months. I did get my book finished by the last video and since then I've picked up this delicious button, which makes me very happy. I had finished my sampler uh, with all the beautiful stitches that Rachel and Sarah taught to us and wanted to take some of these stitches directly into my cover page. Uh, very specifically this uh, double running stitch, wrapped double running stitch, the bullion stitches, this fly stitch. Uh, as soon as I kind of created this little piece, I knew that this would work perfectly for seaweed in my cover page. And so this is my cover page. And you can see those stitches, that, that double wrapped running stitch, uh, the fly stitches. Um, I did do couching down here, but I ended up covering, covering the yarn so much with these little bullion stitches that you can barely see the yarn anymore. But I kind of couldn't stop myself apparently. Um, I also did a lot of um, deconstructed French knots and I like this deconstructed look. They really look like, looks like little water bubbles to me. And you can see I've used a lot of that fly stitch to create the, um, what do you call it? Seaweed, seaweed. <laughs> uh, I also really like this stitch, which is a, a V stitch linked to a chain stitch. Um, I think that that works very well also for seaweed. And lots of tiny little seed stitches to create texture in the background. So I had a ton of fun creating my cover page. I am working now on the first page with the prompts of lace and rabbit. Uh, I've just gotten started. I've got my moon created. In a lot of cultures, the hair is connected to the moon. Uh, and a lot of design motifs in China, uh, Mongolia, and my own personal spiritual path, which is a Celtically inspired spiritual path, have uh, the motif of the hair and the moon, because the moon is often a stand-in for the goddess, and the hair is seen as a particular um, familiar, if you will, of the goddess. So I've got my moon and I'm going to use lace down here for snow. Now I'm going to tell you that I was perhaps not as excited as other people when lace was chosen as the background theme. I am I'm not a fan of lace. I mean, I like it fine in other people's work and I've really enjoyed seeing other people's work on Instagram. And for myself, I just don't like working with lace but it's, I'm gonna use it for my snow and then my hair will go sitting uh, under the moon. So I've got my moon started, um, some uh, lots of French and colonial knots, uh, this little thing that I learned on Sarah Humphrey's channel the other day, but I don't even know if there's a name for it, um, and uh, running stitch and chain stitches and French knots. So I'm working on that and I look forward to seeing everyone else's pages and I'm having a great time. Thanks.